presentation of TFNN. The Tom O'Brien Show is produced every business day. Tom takes your phone calls toll-free at 1-877-927-6648. Internationally at 727-873-7618. Let's go to our man, Al in Homo Sasa. What's going on, brother? It's, isn't it wonderful? I went ahead and invested in your uh, Tiger Dollars, <laughs> and I went ahead and got the gold report <laughs> for a year, and, and also your, morning, your, your call letter and stuff like that. Like that and I got over a fifty percent return in one day, not <laughs> counting uh, everything else. But I just want to thank you. Tom's not perfect, but he tells you how to put your stops in, and he keeps your losses small. You can take your small losses, but then all of a sudden you'll be like Dave Root, and you'll hit a home run. I mean, a big home run. Yeah. And put the money in your pocket. Okay, I mean, brother, I you're awesome, man. Thank you. Now, Tom O'Brien. <laughs> Folks, this is Tom O'Brien of TFNN. We go five days a week. We go seven hours a day. We go 24 hours a day in the internet at TFNN.com. Always remember, folks, whatever you think about, you bring about whatever you focus on grows. Hope everyone's having a great day, safe day. It's a TGIF, and we're calling it to Christmas, folks. So Merry Christmas, Happy New Year, uh, whatever type of holiday you're celebrating this uh, weekend. Uh, Make it a great one, folks. Be impeccable with your word. Manifest your true intentions. Regardless of what language you speak, your intent will be manifested through the word. What you dream, what you feel, and what you really are will be manifested through what you say each and every day. I love that card. Market wise, let's take a look at it out here. We have the Dow Industrials up four, NASDAQ up 30, S&P's up eight and a half. Gold, gold contract up $14.10, trading at 2,065 an ounce. You get silver down 16 cents, $24.42 an ounce. Light sweet crude off 25 cents, $73.64 a barrel, notes and bonds. 10 year note, flat, 112.21. The 30 year down two at 123.29. You get the 10 year right now yielding 3.895 and King Dollar. King Dollar's down 151 ticks, trading at 101, 692. Euro 110, yen 142, British pound 127 to one US dollar. Our phone number is 877-927-6648. Give us a call, folks. Wanna know what's going on in your world and the world of the S&Ps. Let's go take a look at what we have out here. So, you know, we know that you have the the aspect of no liquidity out here today. We take a look at the SPY. You know, the SPY is in an ABC structure up, man. You know, we're at 473, 502 is the number. You know, so we'll see if we get there or not. And bottom line, it's an ABC up market, folks. <laughs> and, uh, you know, you put this on a weekly. I'll show it on the weekly. It's, it's a clean ABC, man. You know, you can see... A to B, blew away the B point, blew it away with volume last week. You know, so we haven't even reached the highs yet, but you do have that ABC structure up, as you do inside the NDX 100 also. Doesn't mean, you know, that yeah, you can't get negated, but my take is that we're going to go. The reason my take is going to go is, let me go right here. You go into the note and bond market. When you go into the note and bond market, the bottom line, you can see notes are hanging tough at 112. 21. This is the 10 year, right? And then the dollar is not holding price. You know, so the dollar is just grinding all the way down to this 99 level. We hit 101.425 today. So my take is that, you know, we're going to be there probably by, we can be there by next week. Well, no, not, the next week's only a three day week. It was a four, it's a four day week. Yeah. Hey, that, that's, that'd be pretty easy to do, actually. Let's go to our man, Frank in Gloucester. Frank, what's going on, brother? Hey, Merry Christmas, buddy. Merry Christmas. How you doing, man? Oh, very good, thank you. Hanging in there. Good. Getting, uh, get, getting things done. Uh, but um, I'm, I'm loving your gold report. I'm making money there. Thank you. But I have this stock, and it, I thought I had an ABC up, and... Um, 
I thought I had a clean break of a swing high with higher volume, but maybe you can take a look at it because it's gone nuts. Okay. Uh, EFC, Ellington Financial Corporation. Okay, so let's take a look. Ellington Financial. Okay, so the low for the year is 1081, the high is 1441. Okay, so it's a mortgage finance company. Okay, a company invests yep. in residential and commercial mortgage-backed securities, consumer loans, collateral loans, non-mortgage derivatives. Okay, so they do, well, this quarter, that's interesting. They've been doing 100, they've been doing 24 million a quarter, and this quarter they're gonna be doing 42 million. Yeah. So I wonder if they took someone over. That's interesting. Most of the time when that happens, yeah. they take someone over. Okay. Okay, so let's take a look. Okay, so we good? Yeah, Frank, I, I'd, okay, let, let me, I would stay right where you are. Here, let me, where, where, where are you looking at the ABC? Um, the end, uh, the A is the end of October. Uh, is it on a daily or a weekly, or Frank? I got. Is it is it and up to twelve? I'm, is it a daily or a weekly? Daily. Daily. Okay. Cool. Go ahead. Go ahead. I'm sorry. Go ahead. Yeah, that's okay. B point is uh, twelve seventy one, uh, beginning of November, and then it retraced. Well, uh, I don't know how you look at it between three eight two and fifty percent. Yep, yep. And it started taking off again, and then it it broke the B point with more volume. Considerably more and just volume. sitting there. There's about a million at the B point. I broke it with 1.2. Uh, yeah, I see. I see right where you're looking at right now. Right now. Okay, so you got this. But then there were those two huge down volume days, the middle of December. Yeah. And it kind of gave you the willies. I, they're okay, Frank. I think. The, the first one, I can see yeah. the first one that rejected lower price and it didn't get to the swing point, okay? And then right, the second right. one, you can make the case that it was actually pushing higher with volume. Okay, yeah, yeah. I, I would stay right where you are here, man. And, and the, the, the yeah. main reason yeah. is that, oh yeah, see on the weekly, on the weekly this is nice, Frank. See, see this weekly? I just put this weekly up. That weekly is pushing yeah, this other it. swing point on volume, man. And, it's and got a the, great dividend. I got a thirteen percent dividend on it. Oh, look at let me let's, let me look at this. Okay, so now they're saying it's eight and a half, but that's because it went up a little, probably. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Right. Um, and one of the main reasons that I'd stay right there, Frank. Okay, is that the business they're in, right? I don't know how many commercial mortgages they're going to do, but what has happened, you know, is that because this interest rate has come down so fast. You're going to see mortgage companies make money again. You know. Well, that was the idea, getting into it, right? Yeah. You know. Yeah. Just, just stay there for a second, Frank. We'll get a quick break, and we'll be coming right back. Okay, you, sure. We have the uh, Dow Industrials. The Dow Industrials right now, uh, uh, folks, uh, trading up seven. Nasdaq's up 33. S and P's up nine and a half. Stay right there, folks. We'll come right back. Currencies, commodities, and bond markets are as important as ever right now with how they're driving the volatility in equity markets across the globe, which is why it's a great time to try out Teddy Kegstat's Tiger Forex Report. Teddy Kegstat breaks down the Forex markets every Monday using his 30-plus years of experience as a trading veteran of futures, Forex, stocks, and options. Teddy releases his weekly Tiger Forex Report every Monday morning with coverage of all the major currency pairs, including the dollar index, the euro dollar, pound dollar, dollar Swiss, dollar yen as well as many more and he also has weekly coverage of the crude oil market and the 30-year t-bonds as they both influence forex markets tremendously when you sign up for the tiger forex report you also gain instant access to teddy's 60-minute webinar archive he just hosted forex strategies and fundamentals what is behind the tiger forex report for all the details and to start your 30-day tiger forex report subscription today visit the front page of tfnn.com tfnn educating investors are you ready to take your trading to the next level? 
Introducing Tom O'Brien's award-winning newsletter, Market Insights, your key to successful active trading. Tom O'Brien, renowned for his expertise in the financial markets, has designed Market Insights to be your daily guide to profitable trades. Tom publishes his daily Market Insights newsletter every market day before the market open, along with updates when warranted. Stay ahead of the game with Tom's real-time analysis and trade recommendations delivered straight to your inbox. Whether you're a seasoned trader or just starting out, Market Insights provides the edge you need to navigate the markets with confidence. Ready to join the ranks of successful traders? Head over to TFNN.com and subscribe to Market Insights today. Don't miss out on this opportunity to supercharge your trading results. Market Insights comes with a 30-day money-back guarantee for all new subscribers, so you have nothing to risk. Don't miss out on this opportunity to revolutionize your trading game. Head over to TFNN.com right now to join the thousands of traders who have already experienced the power of Tom O'Brien's award-winning newsletter, Market Insights, firsthand. TFNN, educating investors. TFNN has just launched their new trading room, The Tiger's Den, hosted at Discord. TFNN has been educating traders for more than 20 years with live programming hosted by a variety of professional traders during market hours. And now they are expanding their reach with The Tiger's Den, available to all tigers and tigresses for just $1 for the year. There's no catch or added costs when you join our community of traders. In The Tiger's Den, you can look over the shoulders of Tom O'Brien and the other TFNN hosts while they analyze charts during their live Tiger TV programs and join an interactive trading community with hundreds of members exchanging ideas. Interact with other Tigers and Tigresses as they share trading ideas, news analysis, and discuss the market action all trading day, even at night and on the weekends. The Tiger's Den at Discord is accessible on mobile or tablets as well, so it's always at your reach. To sign up today and become a part of this educational community of traders, just visit the front page of TF. NN.com. Call now, toll free at 1 877 927 6648. Internationally at 727 873 7618. Welcome back, folks. We're talking Frank from Foster. We're talking about. Uh EFC, which is uh, Ellington uh, Finance. So, Frank, the, you know, he, I think you're on to the right deal here, man. Meaning that, okay. so technically, what you have here, folks, is that you can see on the weekly that bar, you know, from last week, we're pushing a swing point with volume. So, when you push a swing with volume, it's like, okay, you want to go up to the next level, which in this case is the you know, 1421, and as you said, Frank, you're getting a, a decent um, dividend out of it. The thing that's yeah. really cool is this. So picture what they do. What they do, folks, is that they buy mortgage-backed securities inside the commercial market, inside the, uh, the consumer loans, inside the collateralized um, and residential and all of that. Now, I don't know what they have inside their portfolio, Frank, right? But sure. what does happen is this. Everything that they've been buying, let's say for the last year and a half to two years, right, is going to have a high interest rate structure, okay? And mm -hmm. so what ends up happening is that our interest rates are going down. Now, as they go down, folks, and this is what's so cool about the bond market, is everything's reversed. As they go down, those mortgages that they bought go up dramatically in price. Because what happens, oh. folks, is this. So just picture something. Picture that they buy, okay, and they, when they do this, you, you, you get them at a discount. Now, the discount they're talking about, I don't know what the exactly discount is, but I'm just explaining inside of the bond market, when you're buying a collateral-backed mortgage, let's say the mortgage is at 7%, well, you might be buying it at, you know, 6.75 or something like this. It's not huge, it could be a quarter percent or something like that, okay? That being said, yeah. every one of those mortgages, as we go down, and interest rate structure, they will go up in principle. You know, so I'd kind of stay right where you are, man. You know, because okay. any any type of play like that to me is, you know, I, I think we've turned the corner, man. You know what I mean? And right now yeah. we're still at restrictive <laughs> rates and the market itself has brought the tenure down. It's just a matter of when the Fed will bring them down. So Okay, yeah. that's what I was hoping you'd say. Something like that. Thank you. Yeah, no, listen, man. This, you know, you've been doing this a long time. This, this, yeah. this rate change is a huge 
like ship folks that is turning okay we don't see this a lot i mean you know we saw the rate change you know two years ago um and that was one of the biggest ones yeah in the last 40 years you go from you yeah, know it's been one the other way for 35 years or more. <laughs> totally yeah. man totally exactly exactly yeah. and you know this one this one's a big one too man this one this one's a big one we're not going back to you know one percent two percent okay but I suspect that 10-year yeah. looks like it's going to go back to 3.25. If it's 3.25, the 30-year mortgage is going to be out there at 5.5%, which, you know, is affordable. Yeah. Let's put it this way. It's, yeah. you know. Hey, my kids are into 4% mortgages. I couldn't be happier. Isn't that yeah. I, I'm telling you, man. All, any, you know, all of us that have something like that, that is pure gold. Now, listen listen to this. This is a, this is a, it, folks. You definitely want to understand mortgages, number one. And number two, what you want to understand is when your children are growing up, you really want to make sure they understand percentages. Because i got to tell you this story. Listen to this story. This is a crazy story. Okay. I had, I had sold this guy a, a home, right? Beautiful home. Now, mm -hmm. picture, these, these homes now, they're going for like $1.1 million, Okay. Now, but right. picture, I've been, I've been doing this down in St. Pete since the crash. So I've been doing it for 12 years, okay? So this guy had bought a brand new home off me for um, 690000 okay? It, you know, I'm going back years now, okay? Because that, that was the price then. And that's a main home with the pool and a carriage home, right? Now, here's okay. the kicker. He had a, a mortgage at 2.2%, 2.2%, okay? Yeah. He calls Bestford and I up about um, seven months ago. No, it's eight months ago, no, eight months ago, right? Wants to sell the home, right? And they were moving back to Sarasota. He had been in Sarasota, moved up here five years, wanted to move back to Sarasota. Bought a new house in Sarasota, right? So I'm talking with him and, and Great guy. I mean, just in, he says, man, he says, you know, it's my mortgage is going to be 6.75%. And I said to him, I says, I says, have you done the numbers yet of what you're actually going to lose giving up a two and a quarter percent mortgage? Yeah. And yeah. folks, OK, when you do this over the, over the course of like 30 years, we're talking about six or seven hundred thousand dollars. Compared yeah. to he for, for what he bought, and then what he sold. We sold this house for nine hundred ninety grand. Okay, um, and so that was great for him. Do you know what I mean? He but but you get the gist of it. It's like there's so many other things that could have been done there, and, and it wasn't up to us to you know say that to him. He just wanted the the yeah. sale. But yeah. right off the bat. You could have rented that house for six thousand a month, <laughs> and he still right. would have. Anyway, you get the gist of it. If you don't do the numbers on a very large number, I mean, you're just giving up so much money, man. You know, so I, I mean, I think it's going to yeah. stay tighter than people think. Like, you know, you you hear a lot of the folks, you know, Frank, that are saying, okay, yeah. You know, it come down another percentage point. It's going to release a lot of houses. I think it's going to release some houses. I don't think it's going to release a lot of houses, man. You know? Yeah. Because I think some of those numbers, you know, and because of the rent structure, the rent structure is a high. So it's like if you can afford to yeah. rent it, well, then rent it. And then you can still cash out, you know, when these rates get lower. You know? Anyway, so. Yeah. yeah that's. Good, good advice, Tom. Sage it's, advice. It's wild, man. Well, listen, man, yep. you have a great Christmas. Happy New Year. Thank you for all the support, yep. Frank. And uh, tell everyone I yep. said hi. You too. Okay, man. I've got uh, to take this crazy new dog to the beach, and it's 32 degrees because she has to run. So That is awesome. Uh, so you get a new dog. What, what yeah. kind of dog? What's, his, what's her name? Oh, God, it's a mutt. It's Willow. And, uh, Perfect. It's a cross with uh, a, a red lacy and a uh, an Australian cattle dog, and she's nuts. Perfect. Mutts, mutts are where it's yeah. at, man. Mutts are beautiful. I love mutts, man. Yeah, totally, man. Yeah, yeah. yeah. He's great. He's great. Totally, man. All right, bud. Okay, man. Have a great one. Have a safe one. Make sure you get that mutt uh, 
some good Christmas presents, some good ba bones. They need bones, <laughs> and they're gonna already got them. they're gonna Thank chew you. all your wife's shoes, and you gotta go to the nostrum and go get some uh, shoes. Geez. <laughs> well, I think we're past that. She was doing the baseboards, and my wife put a Vaseline on there and put on some hot pepper. And uh, <laughs> she woke up one day very thirsty. Oh, my so God. She didn't do that again. I love it. I love it. <laughs> okay, man. Have a great one. Have a safe See you later. one. Dow. Dow Industrials right now up 11. Nasdaq's up 35. S&P's up 9.5. Stay right there, folks. Come right back. You might think that if you want to be successful at trading in the stock market, you're going to need a crystal ball. After all, it's impossible to predict the future, right? Like any endeavor in life, before you decide it's impossible, get some advice from the experts. You might find that it's not so impossible after all. For daily market overviews that give you direction on the key indices, selective stocks, and commodities, subscribe to the opening call newsletter at TFNN.com. The opening call newsletter is written by Basil Chapman, creator of the trading methodology known as the Chapman Wave. The Chapman Wave up-down sequence gives you an edge in identifying price turns, finding the peaks and valleys in stock prices. Get the opening call newsletter by Basil Chapman in your inbox every day. First-time subscribers also get a 30-day money-back guarantee. If you're not satisfied, let us know, and you'll get a full refund within 30 days of signing up. TFNN.com, educating investors. Steve Rhodes started his trading career as a student almost 20 years ago, and the student has now become the master. Steve won the prestigious Timer of the Year Award in 2018 and barely missed that mark again in 2019, finishing at number two for the year. An amazing accomplishment. Steve Rhodes is committed to sharing his techniques and knowledge with anyone who wants to learn. And he shares his vast amount of trading knowledge every day in his Mastering Probability newsletter. Steve's award-winning newsletter, Mastering Probability, is delivered every trading day with updates throughout the afternoon. Sign up for Steve's market newsletter, Mastering Probability, and you'll receive access to seven of Steve's educational webinars absolutely free. At TFNN, all our newsletters Letters come with a 30-day money-back guarantee, so you have absolutely nothing to worry about. Visit TFNN.com and try Mastering Probability 30 days risk-free today. TFNN, educating investors. Sharpening your skills as an investor is like getting better at playing a musical instrument. You have to practice, sure, but you also need excellent instruction from experts. At TFNN, you'll get advice and guidance from the authority in technical market analysis. And it's not just dry, tedious text either. TFNN airs live financial content streamed live on TFNN.com and TFNN's YouTube channel with Tiger TV. Live every market day from 8.30 a.m. to 4 p.m. Eastern. For free, each host is an experienced trader and gives their take on the market while taking calls and questions live from around the world. From the moment the market opens until the closing bell sounds, Tiger TV has eight different shows with expert hosts to help you make the right moves with your money. Watch online at TFNN.com or on TFNN's YouTube channel and become the investor you were born to be. TFNN, educating investors. Don't forget, you can listen to TFNN live on your mobile device 24 hours per day. Go to TFNN.com, then hit Watch Tiger TV. That's TFNN.com, then hit Watch Tiger TV. Oh, welcome back, folks. Uh, Dow. Dow's up by 13, NASDAQ's up 40, S&P's up 10 and a half. Let's go to our man, George, in Newport, Richie. George, what's going on, brother? Hello, Tom. Good afternoon. How are you? I'm doing great. Yourself? Yeah, great. Just uh, calling to say hi. Well, uh, I've been following you for the last few years, listening to your show occasionally. Well, thank you very much. I, I appreciate, appreciate it, Judge. All the hard work you've done for us over the years. Well, I really appreciate and, you calling uh, and saying hi. So, <laughs> yeah, to follow with the previous caller, yeah, the real estate market here in Florida 
has been uh, dynamite over the years. No yes. doubt about that. No, and especially where you live too. I know. <laughs> so what's happening? Yeah. Let, let, let's let's give them a little geography here. So so what happens, folks, is this: is that George is in Newport Ritchie, that's north of St. Pete, right? And what you've had in in, in Tampa is not the St. Pete, also, and that's where all the growth is happening. You know, I mean, you know, because that's the only well, that's about the only place they can go, right? <laughs> yeah. Pretty wild. Yeah, I mean, the building has been going on crazy for the last, uh, I've been in Florida for 20 some years, and uh, you just can see now they're moving even north of uh, yes. like 54, way north, like 52, because 54 pretty much is built up the capacity. So That's now right. Even and going way further north. And that new Veterans Expressway is, is pretty amazing, man. I mean, you know, you can go from, what happens, folks, is that the, when you go north, it's called the nature's coast. And if you ever come to Florida, you know, and if you like nature, I mean, we have nature like beyond belief, man. I mean, it's just gorgeous. And this nature coast is something else between the, you know, whether you want to go in the rivers or, you know, you're basically going, you know, in Crystal River, uh, there's just there's just so much to see, man. It's it's pretty amazing. Yeah, you've seen quite a bit. I've been here just about as long as you have, Judge. So, you know, there's no doubt. And you know what happened, folks? This year in the census, the census, you know, they just come out. Uh, they just well did the numbers a couple of days ago. I mean, this is from the last one, but um, you know, the bottom line is that Florida, Texas, those are the states that are still growing. So pretty cool. And we, you know. There's still plenty of room, so. Yeah. Pretty you cool, Judge. So, yeah, Tom, I wish you a Merry Christmas, you and your family. Merry Christmas. Thank you so much. A Merry and, Christmas uh, to you and yours. Happy New Year. Thanks. And thanks for calling, man. I really appreciate it. My pleasure, Tom. Okay. I'll to your show. Thank you, man. Have a great one, a safe a one. Day. Appreciate it, man. Let's go to uh, John in Orlando. John, what's going on, brother? Good afternoon, Tom. How are you? I'm doing great, man. Yourself? Good, good. Hey, I wanna before I ask about the stock, I wanna I wanna tell you I've been listening to you since your radio days back in '99, uh, 2000. And I appreciate yeah. the call. I haven't heard your voice for a while, man. <laughs> all time, all time. I know. And I appreciate you know, what what you guys do. But the most, most what I, I really enjoy that you brought back to Ord. This guy is as smart as a whip. I'm I am so you. I'm so happy for that feedback. You know. Yeah, because uh, I used to listen to him uh, on your show on Thursdays on the radio. Yep. And he was gone. He was gone for quite a while. Yes, he was. And yep. Yeah. And and this guy is really I enjoy his uh, technical analysis. His charting and all that, oh, really, really. No, I, listen, I really and really I appreciate the feedback because, about. you know, I know, you know, we do them twice a week, but I can tell you flat out, folks, okay, TFNN is about educating everyone, including ourselves, okay? And I'm telling yeah. you, you want to listen to what this guy has to say. This guy taught me so much in 1992, 93, 94. We used to trade live. I mean, I trade a lot more than most people, okay? But the bottom line is, is that if you just study his stuff and, you know, you have to study some of it because there's a lot of ratios, okay? But I'm telling you, man, no one has stuff like this. And, you know, he's, yeah. He's one of a kind. He's he is. Gotta be, he's got to be the number one uh, market, you know, uh, timer. I'm telling you, it's like, he calls it pretty good. He calls it really, really he, good. He does. And, and what I has mean, happened over the course of the years is that, like anything else, when you have that much screen time, you, you know, he's developed a lot more ratios. And, you know, you get the gist. And I, yeah, I really appreciate the feedback, man. Yes, yes, because, 
with the technology, you know, with technology advancing, I think he he probably gained more knowledge himself. You know, over yes, the years. Yes, absolutely. Uh, no, because you got to keep changing. Yeah. The market keeps changing, folks. You got to keep changing. Not changing, but there's more things that get you know, you know. It, anyway, it, it's really cool, and that's great feedback for yeah. all for all of us. Yeah, yeah. I want to ask you about coin. Uh, I got in this. Uh, at 80, around 86. Nice. Something like that. This is Coinbase, and, folks. And, and I've, been, I've been holding it. Yep. And uh, it's very, very strong. <laughs> it is. Really it, strong. It's going, yeah. Coinbase, the low for the year, folks, is 31. The high is 178. So it's up 400%. And, you know, this is all predicated on, you know, Bitcoin. Because the higher Bitcoin goes, the higher Coinbase will go. Coinbase is... You know, realistically, the only legit uh, broker dealer for, you know, that's regulation wise. It doesn't mean they won't get sued by the SEC, but they, they seem to have it pretty clean. You know, I would just hang right there and just, you know, I mean, you're so extended that you're going to get some kind of a pullback. But, you know, what you, you, what you really want to do is, and you're probably doing it, you know, John, is you got to trade this off of Bitcoin because. The higher Bitcoin goes, the higher Coinbase is going to go. And, you know, if Bitcoin, you know, I mean, it's had quite a run. So if that pulls back, you get, you got to expect Bitcoin, to, I mean, uh, Coinbase to pull back, you know, so. Yeah, uh, I, uh, I bought in the 80s and then I sold because it was a parabolic move. Yeah. I mean, it's like. Uh, I, I sold in uh, 146 and then I, I got. I got regretted it, and I I got back in at 136, and now I'm holding hold it again, you know. Well, like, you know, another thing know, that you can do, man. I mean, if you if you do any options, man, you know that the premiums are so high on on this, you know, you can sell some covered calls, man. And yeah, yeah, yeah. And that's the way that you can get, you know, just keep rolling them, you know, you just go out a little bit. And you know, because I'm looking at these calls right now, man, and they're they're outrageous, man. Like we're at 175, and if I go out to even February, watch this. This is sick. If you sell, <laughs> you can sell the you can sell the two tens at 1230, 12 12 bucks. <laughs> wow. Yeah. Yeah. So. Yeah, a lot of premium, a lot of premium there. It is. Well, listen, John, man, yeah. have a great holiday. Have a great Christmas, great New Year. Thanks for calling, man. Yeah. And thanks for the feedback on Tim Ward. I really appreciate it, man. Yeah, thank you. Thank you. Have thanks, a man. Christmas. You too. Have a great one. Have a safe one. Stay right there, folks. We'll come right back. If you're looking for potential trading setups in the stock market, then Rocket Equities and Options Report is a newsletter you should try. Tom O'Brien delivers options and equity trades when the markets present them using a combination of fundamentals and technicals. Sign up for Rocket Equities and Options Report today with a 30-day money-back guarantee so you have nothing to risk. For all the details and to start your subscription today, visit the front page of TFNN.com. TFNN, educating investors. Biotech is booming, but for how long? Whether you think the biotech bull has room to run or has run its course, trade LABU or LABD. Direction's daily S&P Biotech three times bull and bear ETFs. Visit directioninvestments.com slash biotech today. An investor should consider the investment objectives, risks, charges, and expenses of the Direction shares carefully before investing. The prospectus and summary prospectus contain this and other information about Direction shares. To obtain a prospectus or summary prospectus, please contact Direction shares at 866-476-7523. The prospectus or summary prospectus should be read carefully before investing. An investment in the funds is subject to risk, including the possible loss of principal. The funds are designed to be utilized only by sophisticated investors, such as traders and active investors. Distributor Foresight Fund Services, LLC. The reality is that navigating financial markets can be risky. Markets can be chaotic and difficult to understand. Having the latest market advice can help you turn this chaos into a key for creating winning trades. 
At TFNN, we understand that it can be hard to find reliable market news. That's why each of our market experts offers their very own market newsletter, a must-have tool for every trader out there striving to find an edge in today's markets. TFNN newsletters cover every aspect of the markets so you can analyze the market before you trade. Try any of our great newsletters risk-free with our 30-day money-back guarantee. Just visit the Newsletters tab on the front page of TFNN.com. TFNN, educating investors. TFNN has launched the Tiger's Den, hosted at Discord. TFNN has been educating traders for more than 20 years with live programming hosted by a variety of professional traders during market hours. The Tiger's Den, available to all tigers and tigresses for just $1 for the year. There's no catch or added costs when you join our community of traders. Sign up today and become a part of this educational community of traders. Just visit the front page of TFNN.com. This program is brought to you by Vista Gold, traded on the NYSE American and TSX under the symbol VGZ. I'm O'Brien! Welcome back, folks. Uh, Dow. Dow's down 39, NASDAQ's up 19, S&P's are up 4.5. So check this out, man. This is... I'm trying to find an inflation calendar but i don't have my pc right next to me anyway listen to this this is like amazing man so i'm gonna bring this over so what happened this morning folks okay <laughs> this is like insane so the united states this morning claimed the seabed of the u.s continental shelf okay that comes off of um alaska now, check this out. This is what's amazing. The United States extended its claims on the ocean floor by an area twice the size of California. Secure and rights, of course, to you know, everything that's on the bottom. Now, this is the kicker, man. Where do I show you this? You got to remember something. So we bought Alaska off Russia in 1867 for $7.2 million. Two cents an acre. Okay? That's what we paid. Now, watch this, though. If you're watching Tiger TV... Look at this. So the, the way that the international boundaries work is that when you do have actually continental shelves, continental shelves submerged are the property of the closest country. OK, that's the that goes back. It doesn't go back that many years. They, when I was reading this article, it goes back about 30 or 40 years that they, they signed this whole deal. But when you look at this, look at this just for a second. Because two different things you're going to see here. Number one, Alaska's got, I mean, Russia's got to be going out of their mind that they sold Alaska, number one. But the continental shelf itself, this thing is like freaking huge. And then what is also going to happen, this is where, you know, Canada is huge. There's no doubt about that. And there's going to be a little overlay with Canada. So I suspect we'll make some kind of deal with Canada because we're grabbing parts well, it has this saga that we're grabbing pots that are contested also. But just look at the size of that grab. That is a land grab, folks, <laughs> in a monster way. And, you know, it's a legit land grab. Well, it looks like it's a legit land grab anyway. And you can see the difference. See the difference on this map when you go down to the Atlantic Ocean? Because there, what ends up happening, the shelf drops off. And then it's just wide open. Where up in the uh, uh, Arctic, that shelf goes that far. And if you haven't seen, you know, how actually a shelf works, it is like phenomenal, man. I, I've, you know, uh, I've never dove, you know, with tanks going down. But off the Cayman Islands, we get out of the Caymans a lot because it's only an hour and 20 minutes away. Um, what happens is that you go out and you don't even have to go out like 20 minutes 20 minutes off seven mile beach there's a drop off and the water's so clean you can you know you don't see all you don't see down a lot well you're seeing it down 50 60 feet but this thing drops off like 2,000 feet folks and it's really cool a, a, 
a shelf and a drop off is absolutely phenomenal if you've never seen one. I'm sure there's probably on YouTube or something, there's probably some of them, but and that's where all you talk about fish and species and talk about layered. That's that's when you actually see layered schools of fish and how the feeding gets one on top of the other on top of the other. It's it's phenomenal, man. I mean it's just you're talking about life, man. <sighs> Teeming life in a monster way. And yesterday was the solstice, so now what we have, especially here in Florida, which is really cool, well, for all of us, every day gets longer now. <coughs> Excuse me. Now, what will happen in Florida, and this happens, let's see, today's the 22nd. Yeah, we, we get it about another 40 days, 45 days. In about 45 days to 50 days, folks, okay, what ends up happening is that the fish in South America, they start making their way up the coast and when you see the, the, the water, it is just a mind blower, man, because the different specimens of fish that come right off the coast going, you know, it takes them a while to, to get up to New England, Canada, but we have this twice a year and it's just really cool, man. I mean, you know, the dolphins are always here because there's so much fish. Uh, but when you actually see the, the migration of them, it is phenomenal. And where Steve lives, uh, the difference, the, on the Gulf Coast where we are, that's the west coast of Florida, you have to go out a lot further. We don't have to go a lot further to see the migration. But for bigger fish, we have to go out a lot further, like at 35 miles. Where Steve Rhodes lives, right, you literally only have to go out about 500 yards that's how the drop-off in Fort Lauderdale, Boca, you know, all that area of that literally is about 500 yards. And you are talking about every specimen in the world. Not in the world, but that, that's, that's going up. And the difference is the, they're, they're larger fish, uh, the whole ball of wax. Rough of water, but beautiful fishing, man. Insane fishing. Market-wise out here, you know, hey, listen, com coming into 2024, folks, okay, what you want to keep your eye on is keep your eye on the rates, keep your eye on the dollar, you know, because I suspect what we have right now is that rates number one, yeah, let me put this up for 10-year, because I'm going to put this 10-year yield up chart for up first because this is this is going to be one of the signals also you know tim wood we're going to use his ratios no doubt about that but one of the signals here see this is a 3.8 if i take this and you put this on a few you're going to see that the bottom of the consolidation which that's where i think we're going that's 3.24 okay so when this market stops going higher, okay, so if you're bearish in the market, key, you want to keep this in mind. When this gets down here, this is when the market's going to be, I mean, it's extended right now, but it's going to be extended beyond belief. And see how much support's there? I think we're going to be trapped here for a bit in the 10-year, which is 3.24. And then we go over to the dollar, and you, want, you, want, you, could, you could combine these. And then you take the dollar... And then we put the dollar, and you can see the bottom of the consolidation, and we're getting close to it. It's, it's uh, you know, it's 99, 98 in, there, in that area. Those, when those two line up, that's going to be, I suspect, the S&P maybe finishes ABC up by then. The, the ultimate would be the ABC finishes ABC up by then. The Qs finishes ABC up by then the dollar and bonds come back to that point, then you can hit the shot button. Until then, I wouldn't be hitting no shot button, man. And this is, this is a 1996 uh, market, folks. 96, 97, 98, you know, whole ball of wax. Stay right there, folks, come right back.
Are you ready to take your trading to the next level? Introducing Tom O'Brien's award-winning newsletter, Market Insights, your key to successful active trading. Tom O'Brien, renowned for his expertise in the financial markets, has designed Market Insights to be your daily guide to profitable trades. Tom publishes his daily Market Insights newsletter every market day before the market open, along with updates when warranted. Stay ahead of the game with Tom's real-time analysis and trade recommendations delivered straight to your inbox. Whether you're a seasoned trader or just starting out, Market Insights provides the edge you need to navigate the markets with confidence. Ready to join the ranks of successful traders? Head over to TFNN.com and subscribe to Market Insights today. Don't miss out on this opportunity to supercharge your trading results. Market Insights comes with a 30-day money-back guarantee for all new subscribers, so you have nothing to risk. Don't miss out on this opportunity to revolutionize your trading game. Head over to TFNN.com right now to join the thousands of traders who have already experienced the power of Tom O'Brien's award-winning newsletter, Market Insights, firsthand. TFNN, educating investors. Everything in the universe is governed by the Fibonacci sequence. This mathematical principle is responsible for everything from the most aesthetically pleasing artwork to patterns in the stock market. To stay on top of stock patterns you can take advantage of, sign up for the Fibonacci 24-7 newsletter at TFNN.com. When you subscribe, you'll get a weekly report from veteran day trader Larry Pesavento on stocks you need to pay attention to. And you can trust Larry's analysis. After all, he's got 45 years experience as a day trader. Larry will also provide daily charts, videos, and data on the key markets that he's tracking. Expect notifications from Larry on market movement you need to act on at any time. First-time subscribers also get a 30-day money-back guarantee. If you're not satisfied, let us know and you'll get a full refund within 30 days of signing up. Subscribe to the Fibonacci 24-7 newsletter today. TFNN.com. Educating investors. The reality is that navigating financial markets can be risky. Markets can be chaotic and difficult to understand. Having the latest market advice can help you turn this chaos into a key for creating winning trades. At TFNN, we understand that it can be hard to find reliable market news. That's why each of our market experts offers their very own market newsletter a must-have tool for every trader out there striving to find an edge in today's markets. TFNN newsletters cover every aspect of the markets so you can analyze the market before you trade. Try any of our great newsletters risk-free with our 30-day money-back guarantee. Just visit the Newsletters tab on the front page of TFNN.com. TFNN educating investors don't forget you can listen to tfnn live on your mobile device 24 hours per day go to tfnn.com then hit watch tiger tv that's tfnn.com then hit watch tiger tv Welcome back, folks. Uh, Dow. Dow is up, uh, Dow's down 14. Nasdaq is up uh, 31. S&Ps are up 8. And that's kind of all she wrote, uh, you know, uh, coming into this uh, Christmas holiday, folks. Okay, so let's go take a look at the, actually, no, let's look at the gold market before we call it a day here. So we look at this. Yeah, see, this is the second spike. We, this is, the, you know, we got that huge spike, and that has volume in it. Today wasn't bad, 161,000 contracts. This thing's going to blow away all that stuff. Yeah, we know we had an expansion. This is good. Here, check this out, man. We we took out the consolidation of the last six days, and it has volume, and that's amazing for being the Friday before you know the holiday. So this high volume spike up here that it went up, gave the whole thing up, didn't go break a swing. We're going all the way up there. And my bigger picture is and I'll put put this up. This is going to be the 2500 number and you know hey let's the, the 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 abc structure up this is a really large abc structure up and it's on the monthlies and you can you know i mean look at this thing man i mean you know huge consolidation which makes it even more powerful you broke the consolidation we already broke the consolidation so you get the huge leg up you're at 2,052. It's not going to be hard to get to 2,500, you know. 
That's the next, the, that's the move that we're in right now. That's my take on this thing, that we actually are in this move. And, you know, 400 bucks on gold, yeah, that, that, can, that can take a while. Or, <laughs> or you get an incident in the Red Sea and it's not going to take long at all. You know, the Red, the Red, they're going to have to be dealing with this Red Sea, man. It seems like they, yeah, that's, that's what it comes down to. Always remember, folks, the bear can claw your heart out, the bull can run you over, and thank God there's always another trade. Health, happiness, and prosperity. Have a great Christmas. Whatever you celebrate, and have a great one, folks. Have a safe one. And come back Tuesday morning. We're kicking everything off again. Tom, we kick everything off Tuesday morning. Have a great one, folks.